um, this is Tabitha and I'm checking in on the end of my first month of isogenics. So um, I did not weigh at the end because a, I hate scales, and B, I get derailed every time I look at a scale number, and it's not what I want it to be. Even if I have good inches results, and if I feel better, I still question it if it don't, if it doesn't reflect as well on the scale. I can't, for some reason, something in my brain says, um, like it doesn't let me believe that muscle weighs more than fat and that kind of thing. So I don't even own a scale. I have no idea. So I have to measure based on inches and how I feel and how my clothes fit, that kind of thing. So I'm going to stand up so you can see from the last post, which was two weeks ago. So here is where we're at. So front. Side. And back. Okay, so there's that. And now for the results, I just did my measurements on here. You can see there. And when I started, I did weigh 218. Uh, the last time I checked in, I was at 205. And then this is today's results. So once I measured everything, um, I came up with, um, as of day 30, my total inches lost for the whole month was 15 and a half inches. So, go me. Mm -mm, go me. <laughs> um, but that's not the best part. The best part is that yesterday was Thanksgiving and we went over to my sister-in-law's house and they had a ton of people over. We ate um, pretty good and I had my shake that morning, so I wasn't totally starving by the time food rolled around, so I didn't pig out, which was great. I still ate probably more than I should have, but it's Thanksgiving. So, um, but the best part was that we played games, and then um, afterwards, my husband and I went outside with all the kids, and they were ages like six to about age 17, um, and we played capture the flag, and freeze tag and hide and seek in the dark and what was that other one sierra um, infected. Oh, infected so that if you get tagged then you uh become one of the infected and then you have to chase other people and you're you're it too so anyway in the past i would have stayed inside and um hung out with the grown-ups and been very very mature and with my coffee and my um talking Anyway, but instead I went outside and played and I haven't played like that in, uh, I don't know, years. I was running around with the kids. I captured their flag. Yes, I captured it. And then they captured me and I got a cut on my hand, but it's whatever. It is what it is. Um, my husband also caught the flag, their flag, and um, he ran into a tree. It was dark out. <laughs> It was dark and it was snowy and we, it was freezing cold and anyway, we were soaking wet and, and it felt amazing. Today I'm very sore. Um, but that is the best result that anyone could ever ask for is the energy that's coming from dropping all of these inches and pounds and all of that stuff. It's like, it doesn't mean anything until you actually get to see the results of you going to play and being involved with these kids who are just insane and fast and cool and I just I don't know I had so much fun so that's what's going on with me in this this world I also um, I'm still doing my running today was another 5k training day so I did um, it's just, basically it's really super simple you just follow the couch to 5k programs like Hal Higdon um, just google that anyway and it's like a five minute warm-up which is just walking at whatever pace you want to I do three um, on the treadmill and then I'm at the point now where it's run for three minutes and then walk for two minutes run for five walk for three run for five walk for three run for two walk for one and then I run at like the fastest speed I can which is right now it's a 7.0 not really that fast I mean well that part's fast but all my run times before that are usually at a five um, which is better than I did when I was training for a half marathon back last year so 
I'm already picking up speed, which is great. Uh, another plus. Also, I posted this on the Isogenics page, but I'm starting to see more veins in my hands. Um, can't really see them here, but I'm seeing things that normally um, I wouldn't see. And my, my wedding ring is like super loose, falling off, which I don't want it to fall off. <laughs> I'm going to have to get that fixed. But but yeah, so anyway, that's what's going on with me. And um, I will keep posting every once in a while and let you know how I'm doing. Thanks for watching. Bye.